one of the things I'm always being asked is how do I make my water safe? Well, that's very simple. The first thing is I make sure I contain it in a very simple bottle. There are lots of new fancy bottles with tubes coming from bladders. They're very good at making sure that you stay hydrated. But always I still have a backup of two good solid army water bottles that hold one litre. They're old fashioned, they've been around a long while, they're simple, and they don't tend to go wrong. I also carry with me a steel mug at the very least so that if I have to, I can boil water. Or better still, a small billy can. It's easy to forget that boiling is a very reliable method. One tip when you boil water is that the water must come to the rolling boil, that's when it's turning to vapour and leave it at that point for about two to three minutes, then you should have absolutely no difficulties. When I can't use a fire, then my preference for purifying water is to use a filtration system like this, a pump that will both clean the water through charcoal and then neutralize any nasties that could be in there using iodine. That's my favorite. But in some parts of the world where the water is less suspect, for example in the rainforest I may come across a beautiful fast flowing stream where I think there are a few problems, then I'll just simply use chemical tablets. These are chlorine tablets. They're quick and easy to use. That's the system that I employ. It's kept me safe for years in some of the remotest and least hospitable parts of the world. So far, I've never had a problem. <laughs>